Yo, what's good with y'all? I already know by the title of the video and stuff. We about to make a color changing part Roblox Studio. Now, it's honestly, it's hella simple, like, honestly. When we all see this, by the time we're done, you're gonna be like, it's that simple, because really, it's hella easy. So, yeah, obviously, you need Roblox Studio. Open it up, create a base plate. As you can, we, as you can see, we got the basic plate. plate basic ba base plate. <laughs> Sorry, I can't speak. And then we just got the normal spawn. Basically, to start, what you can do is just go on, head over to model, click part, then block. Well, you can choose either four, because the script will work for either either one. It, it doesn't really matter, but we're just gonna use part for this one. So once you've done part, you wanna head on over to the addition symbol. This is how you add in something, and you can search for things. Then you wanna find script. Click script. Then every time you open a script, it'll have you with this basic print, and then hello world. Just wanna delete that, and then we're gonna be using while loops. If you know what while loops are, it basically means while something is happening, it'll do whatever is inside of it. So when you do while true, it basically is another way of saying while the game is running. True is basically just while the game is running to put it in just simple terms. So you're going to do while true do. Then, you, as you guys know, the main thing for Roblox Studio is referencing. That's how you like the scripting for Roblox Studio. So you want to do game.workspace.part dot brick color make sure you do brick color and not color by accident then you want to do equals to brick color dot new you have to create it or no actually instead of new my fault guys you want to do random and as you guys can just tell it's going to randomize the brick color you can't do dot brick color dot random or anything you can't try that you have to do equals to brick color dot random it's basically creating since you're technically changing something while the game is starting, because keep in mind we're doing while to do. So it's we're not changing something because it'd be different if we just changed it in here. Because then we wouldn't have to do all this. But yeah. So so far, all this would do is just change it one time. So since it's already in the loop of while to do, what you want to do is you want to do wait. Then in parentheses you want to put one. This is basically going to change. Is going to first change the brick color to a random color. It's gonna wait exactly one second, and then you wanna just copy, select and copy what we just did, and just paste it right there. We're gonna wait, it's gonna do it again. And then keep, keep in mind, since it's in a while to do loop, it's gonna loop, it's gonna do the same thing over and over again. Just keep, continue to keep changing the color every one second. And then let's go ahead, go on, head on over to home, click play. Now let's test it, you know what I'm saying? see there it is every one second the brick color changes to some random color it's some random color just any one of the colors that are available in roblox studio you see yeah, it's that simple well i hope, you, hope this was helpful and i'll see y'all later